Hi guys, how's it going? Good, how you doing? Hi there. Doing good. Showing off some beautiful beetles today. So here we have these uh, Hercules beetles. These are from the southwestern United States. This is the western Hercules, and we have a very similar species called the eastern Hercules beetle that lives here in Louisiana throughout the southeast. They look almost identical, but a slightly shorter horn. And those horns are only on the males. So you'll see in this container, I've got two males and one female. So the female there is lacking horns. That's true of most of the large scarab beetles. The males have horns mostly to fight with each other. So they will wrestle for dominance and uh, kind of fight over food and ladies. Y'all are actually welcome to feel it if you want to touch them on the back and feel that hard shell, the exoskeleton. What's that fuzz on this, under his butt? So these guys do have the furry butt there. They actually have hairs, uh, several parts of their body, here on the underside of the top horn, what I call his bangs, right there at the top of his uh, head, and all underneath the abdomen as well. So those hairs are sensory hairs, so they're able to pick up lots of different movements, signals, and uh, vibrations to allow the uh, beetle to kind of know what's going on around him in the environment. So I also have one of the largest beetles in the world. This is actually the Goliath beetle here. So this is an African species. I'm going to keep the lid on this guy since he is an exotic species. And you can see him moving around a little bit. He's awfully slow because this is a very old beetle. These large scarab beetles typically only live around six to eight months as an adult beetle. And we've had this one for almost a year already. So he's long past the uh, expected lifespan of these large scarab beetles. Um, they can actually live a longer lifespan as a larva. So as a grub in the larva stage, they live underground feeding on rotten wood and leaves and possibly some roots. And they can take up to two years to develop as a larva, feeding and gaining strength in order to do that transition, that metamorphosis from the larva to the adult. So just like a caterpillar becomes a butterfly, um, a grub will pupate and become a beetle. Cool, well thanks so much. You're welcome, thanks for coming to the Insectarium guys. I hope you enjoy the whole museum.